Tuesday to everyone. Happy Tuesday, everyone. Welcome to our Kansas Realty Backstage Pass. My name is Tanya Mizell Joseph, and I have the privilege today to be able to share some information with all realtors who are here. But first of all, I want you all to know that I'm going to take some time to have a conversation about why Kanzel, but immediately following, we're going to have a special guest. And to all of our guests out there, if you were invited here, we're going to invite you to stay on with us. Every Tuesday, we have a national call at 12 p.m., whereas we get some valuable information to help us to grow our real estate businesses. Today, we'll have Lee Brown. Lee Brown is able to help new agents and seasoned agents as well. They're, she's going to be able to help you to build and rebuild your real estate businesses if need be. And guys, she is really efficient in helping agents to communicate the value proposition by using a system. Um, she's also going to make sure that she share information with you on how you can have an impactful presence in your community. So I'm going to invite you to stay on at the end of this Kenzel presentation. Um, feel free to go ahead and invite other agents on, whether they're in Kenzel or not, because here at Kenzel, we always want to share information to help all of our fellow realtors and real estate agents to be able to be successful. So I want to welcome you guys to our backstage access pass. You know, we're having conversations with agents. Because one thing that we've realized about our profession is that real estate agents don't retire. I've been in the industry now for 23 years. I have owned and operated my own real estate company. You know, I've worked as, you know, a, just a real estate agent or a realtor. You know, now I'm excited to help Kanzel to grow across the nation. But out of all of my years of experience, I have never once been invited to a real estate agent's retirement party. And we kind of chuckle when we see that, but it's absolutely true. And you have to ask yourself, why is that? We're professionals, right? We make lots of money. That's what people think. And I'll let many of us do, right? But a lot of times we're not saving it. And let's take a look at some reasons why realtors and real estate agents are not able to retire. Here are just a few reasons. Um, here's one, no 401k retirement accounts, no retirement contribution matching by an employer, not having to pay more taxes and healthcare costs, difficulty saving money for retirement, rental properties as realtors, for those of us who do have them, we might be making $3,000 a month. We might be spending $1,500, right? When we average that out and absolutely no company revenue share or stock. Today, I'm here to just have a conversation with you and even though you can't talk back, I want you to talk back to me in your head. And there'll be times as well where I'll ask you to drop some comments in the chat. But if you have never been to a realtor's um, or real estate agent's retirement, I want you to put no in the chat for me. You know, when we think about real estate, we think about the fact that we own businesses, right? Besides, we're in control of our own time and money. Um, we're not typically W-2 employees, we're 1099s, and it's all about us. If it's, if it's to be, it's up to me. That's our motto. But we truly should be conducting business in real estate. Most agents are not, are not in business for themselves. Most agents are simply self-employed. And there is a difference. And I want to begin by talking to you about the differences between being self-employed and being and having a real estate business. And I wanna illustrate that by sharing with you Robert Kiyosaki's cash flow quadrant. If you're familiar with this and you've seen it before, I want you to drop in the chat, I have. But if you haven't, I'm happy to be able to share this with you. Robert Kiyosaki said that it's important for us to get on the right side of money. And when I say us, this is not specific to realtors, this is people in general. In order to get on the right side of the money, we have to be in business for ourselves. As you can see on the right side, you see B for business owners and I for investors. Most people fall on the left side as employees, and we know what employees are. They have a job, but self-employed people, which is where most realtors fall, they own a job. I want you to think about that. If you're self-employed, you own a job. That means if you're not working, your money stops. You're simply just like an employee exchanging or trading your time for money. 
In order to get on the right side of money, you have to be a business owner. Who are business owners? They're people who have leverage. They're people who have a system so that if they physically stop working, maybe they're on vacation or maybe they're sick or maybe they just need to take some time off. In order to do that, you have to have money continuously coming in to be a business owner. That is what we want to share with you away is a model that's going to help you to do just that. Not only that, another way you can be on the right side of money is to be an investor. And investors don't work for their money. They allow their money to work for them. And so we're going to show you how you can you know, earn this money as a business owner and then simultaneously be investing money at the very same time. Now, let's talk about our industry. As professionals, it's so important for us to understand our industry. So let's take a little a journey down memory lane and just to talk about and show you how our industry is shifting. So back in 1863, real estate companies were corporately owned. Then a shift happened in 1973, whereas we went to the franchise model. I think about my first company was Century 21. That was a franchise model. Everyone went under that umbrella. We advertised Century 21's logo, their colors, and we did not deviate from that. But the great thing is that people were able to take a system, this system, franchise it and be able to plug into a system without figuring all the stuff out, right? So franchising was great. But then another shift came along in 1983. And this is where you started to see business centers. It allowed for agents to now earn profit sharing. It also positioned agents to be able to promote their own brand. They weren't under you know, the, the umbrella of just that company's name and logo. They were able to um, represent and brand themselves within a company. Well, another shift happened in 2014. And this shift is allowing agents to truly be customers. It's allowing agents to position themselves to be able to be on the right side of money by having a real estate business and also by also allowing them to be able to invest their money. Here at Kanzel, we say we have the now later effect. Now you guys remember this candy? As a matter of fact, I just bought some the other day. <laughs> when I go to the gas station, um, sometimes I'll go in and I'll buy now laters. I love the candy. And I remember back in the day, that slogan was eat some for now, save some for later. Well, our now later effect is about the fact that we have a way for you to be able to earn money now, transact business as normal, but then also to be able to have that later money, that later money for retirement, okay? We need it because remember, go back to the reasons why agents don't retire. Here's the other thing I want to say to you and write this down. Retirement is not an age at all. It's an amount of money. How much money do you need to live the next 20 or even 30 years, right? How much money do you need so that you can stop working so that we can truly enjoy our lives and not, you know, be selling, putting a sign in somebody's yard at 80? <laughs> you know, it's kind of funny, but it's a reality that if we don't become business owners, this is what's going to happen. So I'm going to go through and share with you our now later effect, how you're able to earn money now and later as well. So let's start with what you're already doing. As realtors, we know how to transact business, right? But the awesome thing about being here at Kanzel is that even though you know how to transact business, we're going to help you to enhance that. We're going to help you to increase the number of sales that you have, which is why in the beginning of this presentation or this conversation, I invited you guys to stay on at noon for a guest that we'll have on that's going to help you to enhance your real estate business. Understand here at Kanzel, that's what we do first and foremost is to make sure that you get to transact business, but to do it in a more efficient and effective way. Now, so let's get these questions out of the way. All realtors, when they go to a company, you want to know what's the split, what's the cap, what are my fees? Well, here they are. You're going to begin with an 80-20 split. 80% of the commission will go to you. 20% goes to the company. Then once you cap by, by contributing $14,000 to the company, that's your annual cap, you will then have the ability to go to 100% commissions for the rest of the year. 
Here's another way you can get to 100% commission that you don't see here. You'll have the ability to share this with other agents. If they come on board at Canzel Realty and they are a producing agent, you will get 100% commission with four producing agents within the first 60 days. We have a $50 ENO monthly um, um, fee for ENO insurance and also a $50 tech fee. Now over here, guys, I'm telling you, cost will not be an issue because I'm gonna share with you the value that you get for that technology fee and there's no annual dues. Now, speaking of the technology fee, here is your technology suite that's included for that $50 per month. And as you can see the value, I know that you will agree that this is worth it. KV Core alone could cost you hundreds, not could, but would cost you hundreds of dollars per month. But you get that inside of Kanzel. Some others you see, List Hub, Broker Bug, Breakthrough Broker, Broker Mint, and a Microsoft Office Suite, and the list goes on and on. So that is what you get for your $50 monthly technology fee. Now, let's talk about another stream of income that can be pretty immediate. So what I just shared with you was the now money. And that's what we're used to, right? We take the time, we work with buyers and sellers, we get our commission, we spend it, and we have to do that all over again. I heard someone say the other day, real estate agents are unemployed until our next sale. And we know that to be true, right? And so you have the ability to transact business as normal. As a matter of fact, we're going to help you to be able to enhance those transactions and increase the number of transactions you do through the training that we offer. Now, the next stream, again, can be immediate. It can be like in the middle. I say it's in between our now, later in effect. And this is going to allow you to be able to conduct business. Remember, we talked about getting on the right side of money. Remember, we spoke about being a real estate business owner instead of just, you know, being self-employed as an agent. Well, you'll get to do that from what we through what we call our five-tier rev share program. And understand we're using the words revenue share and not profit share. I want to share the difference because I know that there are some companies out there that offer profit sharing. Here's the difference. Rev share, as you can see it right in front of your face, is the distribution of the total amount of income generated by sales, point blank period, all right? Profit sharing is the distribution of only the profits, the revenue that's left over after costs have been removed. I don't know about you, but I don't want any leftovers. I want my money up front. And that's what you have the ability to do with our five-tier rev share program. Now, what this allows you to do is to be able to build a team inside of a real estate company. I want you to drop in the chat I have if you have ever owned or you own a real estate company. And if you have, like myself, you understand the responsibility that comes along with that. You understand the overhead that comes along with that. So we've had people to join Kenzel simply because they've had real estate businesses. They want to continue to transact business on their own, but they want to release the financial and the physical responsibility, but still be able to get paid on their team. I don't know about you, but the reason why I became a real estate broker and ultimately owned my own company was because I wanted the opportunity to be able to get that passive income. I wanted to be a business owner. I wanted to be able to step away and go on vacation and have time to be sick if I needed to be without worrying about my income stopping. So you have the ability to do that. And when you share this with other people, why are you sharing with other people? Because other agents are looking for a way to be able to retire. Other agents are wanting to earn more money. They wanna be in environments where they're around realtors who are on the cutting edge of doing things to help them earn more money. And they're also wanting to earn leveraged income. And so when you share this with people and they come in, they will all fall on your level one, right? Because you've personally brought them in. So we want to give you the credit. As you can see with this five level revenue share program, you'll have the ability to earn, you know, thousands of dollars per month, potentially earning between 10% and 25% of the company dollar, right? On these agents when they transact business. 
and the amounts will determine will be determined by the number of, of agents that you personally bring in. So if you bring in, if you have just one agent, do you realize that will position you to get paid on three levels of this rev share program? I know that there are other companies out there in order for you to get paid out through three levels, you need five people. We know that most agents, most agents are not going to come over here and bring over five agents because that's not their primary focus, right? So with one agent, you'll be able to get paid out through three levels, and that's at 10% on levels two and three. If you're very excited and want to share this with um, more agents because you see how it can empower them, and you have 15 or more agents, then you're still getting paid out through levels one and three, but now it up opens up level four that will allow you to earn 15% of the company dollar every time an agent sells a property within your organization. You want to unlock level five? Well, on level five is gonna take 25 plus agents. Don't let this number overwhelm you. There is no, There are no quotas as far as your timing for being able to do this. But at level five with 25 or more agents, you're now earning 25%. Now, please keep in mind that the agents that are on levels two, three, four, and five, they're not agents that you personally brought in. Remember, those agents are just on your first level, and the other levels are filled with other agents who have the response who who have been who have been brought in by other agents. So you got get the opportunity to be able to really benefit on leveraged income. Now, here is the later part of our now later effect. I love this. Also, keep in mind the right side of money. The right side of money says business ownership, which I just so eloquently shared with you, and then also investing. So while you're doing what you do naturally, you'll be positioned to be able to earn ownership stock as rewards. We are in our pre-IPO phase. Our goal is to go public, and your timing could not have been better. Because as you come in and as you transact business, during your first closing, once you have your first closing with Kanzel, you'll earn $250 in ownership stock. Every time you sponsor an agent after their first closing, you're going to earn $250 in ownership stock. When you cap, you're going to earn $4,000 in ownership stock. And if you become an influencer by selling 30 plus homes, you will earn $14,000 in ownership stock. Don't forget your cap is 14,000. So if you become an influencer, it's in essence like you getting that money back. But the numbers you see, as you know, if you understand stock may not be the number that you get because that $250 that you get after you have that first closing, it could soar and it could be very well be worth so much more than that in the future. Now, let's talk about the reasons why I joined Kenzel and probably the reason or reasons, because I'm going to give quite a few, why the person who invited you on joined as well. I've already shared with you the revenue share program. It allows you to get on the right side of money and to be in true business for yourself. I've shared with you the opportunity to be able to position yourself to retire one day, right? I'm not saying this is the end all be all, but this is the opportunity that too allows you to be on the right side of money and be able to invest. Here's another great reason. As we have, you'll have access to brokers. Not only do we have one broker for the state, but you're gonna see that we have multiple brokers. We're really big on making sure that you have support. And speaking of support, guys, you have so many different levels of support from a circle leader. I just got off of a circle leader call prior to this call and we have many circle leaders out there that are helping our real estate agents transact business. We have managing partners, we have managing brokers as well. We have monthly trainings, we have weekly trainings, such as the one that we are about to transition into. There's so much as it relates to on-demand training. And right now, you even have the ability to have a one-on-one -on -one session um, with someone inside of Kenzel on whatever you need in order to help you to be successful. Yes, over here as well, you get to create your own brand as long as people know that you're powered by Kenzel. I've already shared with you the suite of technology that we have available to you for $50. 
Not only that, we're all about giving back, guys. That's a principle, right? The more you give, the more that you get. We understand that here at Kenzel. And watch this. You get to feel good about giving back. So every single time your, you help uh, your client or customer um, with a transaction, do you understand that Kenzel will donate 10% of the company dollar back to the charity of your client's choice? So you get to share this with your clients. And it's not your dollar. It's not your client's dollar. It's the company's dollar. You have the ability to generate leads through KV Core. We have people out there spending hundreds of dollars per lead, but over here through Kenzel um, um, Core, we'll, I'm sorry, through KV Core, we'll be able to show you how you can get late leads from three to $15. We have a true 100% commission. You may say, Tanya, there are, there are companies out there who are touting their 100% commissions, and they do. But when you do, you get what you pay for. You're not putting anything into the company and you're not getting anything out. You're not getting the culture. You're not getting the culture. You're not getting access to be able to touch people and talk to people, right? You're not getting the circles that is going to allow you to get information um, to help you to propel your real estate businesses forward. So once you get that 80-20, once you've reached the company cap of the 14,000, you're truly at 100%, but you continue to get all of those things that I shared. We have access to health benefits um, through, through Kenzel Realty Health Group, and you can get more information on that. Guys, we have so much value. Understand this, we're talking about value that you're getting inside of Kenzel. The opportunity for you to not just to be a real estate agent, for you not to just to be self-employed, but for you to have a true business. See, people in the community that you know, they look at you as having a real estate business. Make sure that statement is true. I'm going to yield right now because I want to bring up um, someone who made the decision, a seasoned agent who made the decision to come on board with Kanzel. And not only is he a seasoned agent, all right? Not only is he a seasoned agent, but he is the state broker for North Carolina, so Mr. Rob Williams, please come on and talk to us about why you chose Kenzel and why, it, why it's working for you. Thanks, Tanya. I appreciate that introduction. Um, yeah, I've been a real estate agent now for 20 years here in Raleigh, North Carolina. And <clears throat> last spring, I was working for one of the national iBuyers, right, uh, OfferPad. And I could see the writing on the wall that that was not going to be a place that I wanted to stay given the changing real estate market. About that same time, I had several of my past clients call me and say, hey, we've got our house that we want to sell and you know, do some transactions. That had, uh, added up to about two and a half million dollars worth of sales right there. So I said, okay, I got to land my license somewhere where I can make some decent money. I've been recruited by EXP, the traditionals, all that. And you know, nothing was really sticking out because I had already heard all those stories. But my good friend Jason approached me and said, Hey, there's this new company that's in Raleigh, and they're they're they've got some good things going. Uh, it's uh, you know it's new. Let's talk about it. So he presented some information to me, and I'm listening to him, right? And it's you know it's it's interesting. It's interesting. You know I, I enjoyed that. The whole revenue share was new to me because I'd come from traditional, and I'm sitting here, and finally he goes, "It's pre-IPO," and pretty much pre-IPO completely changed my my interest in this company. Where could I get into a company that's going to allow me to do everything that I normally was going to do with real estate, but now I'm being paid in some stock options or stock shares that are worth a dollar today, but the potential, look at EXP that went to, I don't know, 50, 80, $100 a share. Um, imagine that kind of uh, investment in my future and my retirement. That's when I started thinking about the revenue share. Revenue share was not important to me at first because I sell real estate. I do a lot of business. I'm happy with that. But the more I thought about it, not only am I getting shares of stock, but I'm also getting revenue share by just doing my business, being excited and sharing the good news with any agents that I transact with. And so uh, for me, it was it was revenue share. But top of that is IPO. I want to get into the ground floor of a company where I can influence some things. I can put my thumbprint on how the company is going to be run here in North Carolina. And it was just an exciting time to join a company that 
really has some really cool stuff going. So that in a nutshell is why I joined. Well, thank How's you that? so much. And Rob, before you, before you leave, I want you to really quickly just to talk about the support. Now, I know that you are a part of our support system now as a broker, as a state broker. Um, not only that, you came in hitting the ground running because I think you capped, was it within 30 or 60 days? It was uh, close to 60 days. Yeah, it was pretty fun. <laughs> okay, <laughs> right. It, it was very quick. And so could you speak really quickly to the support? Because I know that many times agents come over, they want to make sure that they have the support that they need. So can you talk a little bit about the support that we have inside of Kinsale? Uh, great point. Yeah, so <clears throat> any agent that comes on board, right, the biggest fear is learning, learning a new system. You know, who do I talk to? Who do I call? Um, the fact that, you know, I'm the managing broker and I'm available pretty much any and every day. I've got a circle leader, Jason, who is also available. Um, plus, we have the whole corporate office that's just as amazing uh, resources for whether it's KV core training, whether it's lead training, any of the programs we offer, there's somebody who is going to be immediately available to help you. So um, I still get training. In fact, Tomorrow I'm doing more KV core training because I believe in continuing to sharpen my saw here. But every person should should know somebody, whether it's the person re who recruits you or your circle leader or even me, the managing broker. Either we know who to connect you with or we've got the answers for you. So that's the other nice thing is local leadership who can really guide you and you know train you, if you will, for how to be a successful agent. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for sharing your testimony. I tell people, you know, real life, real stories here. So I appreciate you, Robin, all that you're doing, not just for North Carolina, um, but for Kansas Realty. And so to our guests, um, I invite you get back with the person who invited you on. Um, if there's more information that you need or more information that you want to see, they can absolutely help you um, to do just that, to get that information. Um, or you can always go to joinkenzel.com to get more information. And we're going to be having these agent attraction meetings every Tuesday at 1130, right before our national call. And as I share it with you, next, we're going to go into our national call to our guests. We invite you to stick around because you're going to hear from Lee Brown. This is information to help us grow our businesses. Lee is going to be able to speak to not only, you know, veteran agents, but, you know, their brand new agents as well. Um, they're going to be able to really assist us with helping us to build and rebuild. Some of us are looking to build, but some of us are also looking to rebuild. And they'll be able to really communicate the value proposition. As an agent, you should know your value proposition and also the system in which you use. So I'm very excited to be able to turn it over um, to Lee and also Chantel. Thank you guys so much. Look forward to, to seeing you next week. All right.